Hey guys, I'm back again with another video. Okay, I know you guys like my story time, so I'm here with another story time. Okay. This is going to be about some racist people at a pizza restaurant here in Brooklyn, New York. Okay, let's get straight into it. Okay. I was shopping. Okay, let me give a backstory. This pizza place has been on Flatbush Avenue in Brooklyn for years. Since I was a kid. I'm 39 now. And, you know, back then, you know, I wasn't driving. And I never had pizza at that place. But I would be passing on the bus and I would see it. So, you know, now, you know, I'm, I have access to a car. So I'm, I'm going all over the place, guys. I don't just stay in my neighborhood, which is um, Flatbush. I go, I go all over. So, wait. So I go all over, guys. I was at Dollar Tree, and I was, you know, buying, you know, you know, you, you guys know I love Dollar Tree. So I was in there, and then I went across the street, and I was with my mom, and I, well, it was around dinner time. It was like six o'clock, so you know the, the the place is you know busy, and they okay, this pizza restaurant, they. Total, they remodeled this place maybe like two years ago. They made it bigger. There's there's seats in there now. It, they have um like waitresses, you know, that bring you, you know, your food. So one of the waitresses uh tells me, cause I'm I'm like, you know, are there any you know available seats? Cause I see it's crowded. And a family had left. And I was waiting for that table. And this lady proceeds to tell me that there are two tables in the back. Okay, no, miss. I would like this table here. Okay? You're not you're not you're not gonna you you're not gonna send me to the back of nowhere. Okay? This is 2017. I know this is not a black neighborhood, you know, it's a white, you know, neighborhood, but I could go wherever the hell I please, you know, once I have access to a vehicle. And you're not going to tell me that I should go to the back, okay? So, let's let's not go there. So then, she's like, okay. They clean down the table. I order the pizza, you know, two slices for extra cheese for myself. One extra cheese for my mom. She wanted to try it. And they had, you know, the you know, the salt and pepper on the table, and then they have like a um like a container for the napkins. So I took out some napkins and they're on the table. This crazy woman comes and picks up the napkin. I'm like, miss! I'm I would like to use those napkins. Why are you taking my napkins? She thought that it was trash. Okay, guys, this person was clearly, I think, racist or something. I don't know what this woman's problem was because I've ate at this place before because I'm always at Dollar Tree and I've never had this type of treatment in my life. Okay, forget about I'm African American. I'm a human, okay? I'm a young lady. That's first of all. Forget about my race. You treat me like everybody else. I'm a human. You know? You don't treat people different because of, because of their race. That's that, that's stupid. That's being ignorant. You know? I treat everybody the same. I don't discriminate. I don't hate anybody. Okay? So that's not my style. That's not my personality. Now, if you did something to me, then I don't like you. That's That's different. You know, but this person was clearly racist. But I tell you one thing, people. I gave a bad review on Yelp. Yes, I did, guys. The place is called Lenny and John's. Yes, 
I'm going to say their name, Lenny and Jones on Flatbush Avenue near Avenue P. That's where the place is. You could go on um, Yelp and you could, um, I guess, see pictures of the place. Now, the pizza was good. I ain't gonna, I'm not complaining about that. It's their nasty, racist attitude that I don't like. Okay, that is what I don't like, guys. Um, so that's just pretty much it, guys. I'm de I was dealing with a racist, crazy woman in the pizza restaurant. It was a quick story time, guys. It wasn't much to tell. But I have more story times for you guys. If you want me to do a series on story times, I can probably do story time um, Thursday or something because I have a lot of crazy stories to tell. Peace.